all right viewers you can you can see what we're trying to portray that is how hard and harsh that lock and um, that grab is now i want us to see how we are going to escape from such how it's possible for you to escape from such grab i will quickly remind our first timers always hit the bell and subscribe leave your comments our esteemed subscribers already will say thumbs up so we are going straight to the action which you have seen already the preamble how it is it possible for you to be able to free yourself to convert this lock this kind of hash lock or hash grab into a lock and free yourself okay now watch out and see this the first thing you do he takes his hash move hash move now what you do is try to place your hand as if you're turning it strike there once you strike there the hand goes weak and you go mm. Pack down from here. No, and convert to this hand. You can convert to any hand. All right? Mm, you still go. Okay, let's see that again. Grabs as hard as he can. Now he's pulling. Last thing is, you find a way, you don't see a way. Now you take your hand as if you are here. He, he still know. He, he doesn't want, or doesn't understand what you're trying to do. You time the in inside of the elbow and strike there. Once you strike there with your own elbow, that's weakened the grip a bit and you go. Like that. All right. Okay. Now let's do that slowly. All right. The grab is on, and you strike here. To weaken that and then turn in and then go and turn it there. And that's it. Okay? Alright? Be careful with that lock. Alright, now let's see the next one. How it takes the lock to be grab again. Okay, the next one back. No, still there. Still there. Still grab this there. Now, this time around, it's harsh. You take your stance back. Now what do you do? Take yourself in. Push here. And what? Ah! See that? You lock him with the grab. You lock him down with the grab. See that? It's locked. Then you can strike your elbow down here. Ah! Alright? Ah. Now let's watch that again. Ah. Let's watch that again. Uh, all right, it locks again, it grabs rather. Now, this time around, you take your leg back. Now, sink yourself in. Now, go to the shoulder here. Press in the shoulder while the elbow is bent and you're pushing yourself in to and then you ah. Now, see that? This time, you are locking not only the wrist, you are equally locking the shoulder. Then, you strike here down and you pull yourself in. Mm, you can uh, see go there. You can see go there. Yeah. But the lock is effective. All right. Okay. See another action still on the, the grab. Now let's let's see how we can um, convert the grab from the back to lock. Now go to the back. There are situations where you'll be grabbed recklessly like this from the back. And you wonder how can you? How is it possible for you to escape this grab? Now you drag and drag. All you need to do take a swift turn in, bam! And that turn, can you see that? The turn goes with a blow. See what happens? That's just the turning, the force, the force, uh, the force of returning alone. I've not applied the punch. Okay. Now that's just one. Now I take that again. I go with that force, pow, to the punch. And the punch, you should have two directions in mind, then you choose one. I give you two options, then you choose one. You might punch to the solar, or you punch to the elbow, I mean the armpit, where the, 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 the shoulder connects to the, sh to the body. Where the arm and the shoulder connect. You take the punch there. Then you now take this down, 
and lock. All right? Okay? That is how it goes. We we'll take it again. Press. A swift turn goes with. Now let me apply the punch to the uh, armpit. Aye, there. One. With this punch here, I tap ah. down. Now you see that the tapping down has brought the hand off. And the next thing is this. Bam! Bam! And you can take that down. The lock is very, very essential. You see that? You can convert it the way you want. All right? Okay. <laughs> because he knows what he's feeling. I told you, when you are trying this out, please be very careful. Otherwise, you will end up dislocating your opponent's hand and wrist without you intending to do that. So, you're intending only to just learn. So, in the process, if you're not careful, you will cause the serious uh, damage. So, now, let's take that again. I'm going to be mild, more mild this time. More mild, you can see he's complaining. It's going to be more mild. All right, so you bear with Whatever you see, he is the one facing it, so he understands what he's facing. So I'm going to be a little bit mild. So all you do is just turn with that force, with a the punch there. That punch, then you strike here down, striking here down, slide, and then turn. Pull out with the turn. Then you, you go there, you go there, or you go there anywhere you want to. But the lock is what you want first hand. The first thing is the lock. Now the lock is successful, then you can do any other thing you want to do to bring him down. Okay? Alright? Now, I don't think we have any possible questions to ask there because everything is clear. But let me add up one more on the back grab. Come back again. I'm still going to be very mild. Okay, this time around, he locks, he grabs it that way. And I turn with that force, like what you saw the first time. The force power takes him up. Now, when the force takes him up, what do you think? Ah, is the yeah. Now you see that? Then you can do whatever you want to do. Power, power from there. All right. Now let me make it very slow so that it will be clear. To be very clear. Now watch this. He takes the graph. Yes, I'm going to be very slow. But watch, the turning yeah. goes with a strike to the, with your elbow, to here, power, which takes him off. Now once it takes him off, you pull. Now that pulling already has caused a lock on his grab here. Then you turn him down. See, sink down, sink down, and ah. there, you are there. Can you see that? Can you see that? He's only hanging. Pam! Finish your big there. Okay. All right, so let's leave that. But I keep saying it, please, when you're trying it out, trying it out, be careful. If you ask him, of course, you've already seen his reactions. He's not finding it funny. It's very, very devastating. All right, we're going to leave us here for today. If you will come your way next time for some other exciting actions, please stay tuned. I Let me quickly remind our first timers, please do hit the bell, subscribe, and leave your comment. Then for our esteemed subscribers, we will not hesitate and we will not stop telling you thank you. So we'll come your way next time.